I have a down position. I've been nursing. It doesn't matter. It'll come back. It's only down. It's a heavy trade, but it's only down 6%. Look, can you 100x Bitcoin without cross leverage? I'm on isolated at 100x. What's the difference? Where's the spread? Your liquidation is drop dead at 68,102. We are at 67,604. This was an accident, but I wanted to use it as an opportunity to prove to you what happens. Now, what can you do here in this situation? I want to take profits. I want out of this, but I'll show you. One thing you can do is come here and pull your leverage back like that, but it puts more money in the trade. Okay, I want to get out of this. I don't want to be in this trade. Eight, hold on. So look, my leverage has been moved now to 68.8. I mean my liquidation price. Hold on, I'm trying to get out. Flash close. All right. So that's what happens. All right, now I still have this. I'll win this later. It was down much more. I accidentally put in that trade. Okay, can you trade isolated and trade Bitcoin? Yes, you have to have, it's going to use more of your wallet if you start at 100X, okay, like this. It's going to give you a close liquidation price. you got to watch it. Now, if you're down 50%, pull back on the throttle. Let me see where Bitcoin is anyway. Oh, people are getting liquidated here. Maybe I should put a long in. I mean a short in. All right, we have indecision here. Where are we on the three minute? Oh, we're at a local bottom. Let's take a screenshot. All right, so I want, I just made a mistake by not being on cross. Usually I like to trade cross, but I feel lately isolated is better. I usually use isolated only for altcoins, okay? And I like to only short the biggest, most ridiculous winners. There's not even that many anymore. That's why I'm in my altcoin short. Okay, these were up like 30% yesterday. All right, so can you trade? You know what? I'm going to put in, let's see. Uh, I'm at a local bottom. I can't do it here to show you guys. You know, I'll do it with a small amount of money. All right, so let me show you. You might want to try this. Cross uses your entire wallet. Isolated uses only what you put in the trade. So let's do it right here at 99X. Now keep in mind, one... I'm going to do $111, sell short. I should do it at market. Since it don't matter, we're doing it for an experiment. All right, you ready? On isolated, let me show you exactly what happens. Let's just do a small amount of money. $11 at 99X. Hold on. Okay. So let's check this out because we're all used to using cross leverage. All right. Now, isolated means it cannot wreck your whole wallet. But it gives you a problem, especially at high leverage. Your liquidation price is very close. Let's look at this, right? Right now, you're in a short that is isolated. The price is 67,543. Right now, okay, you would be liquidated if this thing, well, I can't do it this way. If it goes up, you can see it's about $400 spread. Okay, if it goes up to 67957 which it could, you'd be liquidated. What do you do in that instance if you're on isolated trade? You only want to risk what you put in the trade. Well, you started very high with the leverage. Watch my liquidation price. Watch my balance. Here's how it works. You can pull back to say 50x. Confirm. It'll work as long as you do not have any open orders. If you have open orders, you must cancel them or you'll get an error. Now at 50x, look, the number has shot up to over from 67.9 to 68.625. You can't really see the difference because it's so small, but it took more money from my wallet. I don't advise playing with the leverage. If you can win at 100x, great. Okay. If it goes against you, pull back to 50x. Okay. 
This is how you use isolated. Now, if it's going against you and you want to stay in the trade and survive, you just want to make it, this is going to add more money from your wallet. But watch the liquidation price now. It's 70089 Again, I'm not putting in huge amounts, so you can't see it really affecting my balance. Okay. Now, you still want to stay at a good speed. There's another way to do it. Are you ready? Okay. You can take this pencil and feed the margin directly from your wallet. And it will tell you this is after you've reduced leverage. Reducing leverage is the best, but it'll take the biggest chunk out of your wallet. But when you win, even at 12x, you'll have a heavy trade. Heavy trades do very well. This is something that little people, very few people know of. It's to increase, I've never reduced, but increase the margin. Here is my account balance, okay? This is my current liquidation price. As I put money into here, and click, if I click confirm, it will increase my liquidation price, my margin, pushing away liquidation. It's a little known trick. I only use this on the tunics. Sign up in the link below or in the top of the comments. It's free, no VPN, no KYC. Watch, if I put $4,400, look, $444 in this trade, it would take $100,000 to liquidate me. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> That's why you gotta have money in your wallet to play the game. I'm gonna close this little $8 example here. But I just wanted to show you what you can do. I'm in an altcoin battle right now. I will devastate it. When Bitcoin falls, it will tumble. Anyway, so I hope you found this helpful. If you did, tell me in the comments. Again, if you are notified by YouTube that this video has premiered or, or been aired, you should unsubscribe. Subscribe again if you're a fan and click all notifications. Leave a, a like to show the algorithm that you do like real content strategies. Have a good day.